Ever wanted to have your own movie theater that played blockbuster movies for you and your audience? Well, today is the day of how to set that up and get your movies flowing. And stay to the end, we'll also show you how to set up a karaoke bar. But first, spin that logo. What's going on everybody? Israel Galindo here from the MetaQs and MetaLore. If you've been around the metaverse for a while, you often run across a movie theater where you can just go and watch a movie by yourself or with others. But what if you wanted to add that movie experience into your own space and your own world so you can have the comfort of your own space and bring your friends to party and watch a movie with you in your own time? Well, this is definitely the video for you. But first, we quickly want to do a shout out to our friends in YouTube out there that have been following our journey and our channel. Right now, we've got some special shout outs to our friends called Meta Shouts to Dr. Michelle Davis, What's Up, What's Up, Mommy Guide Inc., Metaverse Music, Trey Driggers, and J Money, and our very own Marcy Bressler, part of our MetaQs, who's not here today. But I wanted to also give a shout out to them as well and let them know. Thank you for the support, thank you for the patronage, and for following our videos as we are bringing them to you in the mix with Israel Galindo. Okay, so as stated, this is knowing that you already know how to build the world and you're able to edit that world and add MREs to your space. If you don't know how to do that yet, we're gonna link a video that shows you how to do MREs as well as world creation for you. Now, if you've already gone past that part and you know how to do that, Today we are going to show you two different MREs, the movie theater MRE and the YouTube channel MRE that you can both get. Okay, so the first thing we're going to show you is where your MREs are stored, where you're going to put them so you can easily get to them and not have to type them line by line. So the first thing you want to do is on your computer, you're going to go to the altvr.com website, which is the Altspace VR. Dot com site. If you have not gotten in there, register an account so you can go in there as this is going to be your mecca to go in there and be able to add these MREs, edit worlds, and find groups and friends that will really give you the benefit of having all of the pieces you need for a great metaverse experience. So under more, you're going to see there is an area called MREs. When you go in there, you're not gonna have anything in there. It's gonna be empty, but I'm gonna actually pull one up right now so you can kind of see what we're gonna be doing. This is what's called an MRE, the WSS MyScreen dot dukes vr dot tech so this is uh what an mre it's code that animates whatever you want it to do you have an mre to bounce the basketball you have an mre to create a movie theater you have an mre to create drinks that you can pick up yourself anything that you inter interact with so this is what we're going to end up doing now before we do that some of the theaters that you want to look at um online is complex movie theater Duke's 3D Movie Theater. You've seen these in all space all over the place. So Duke's is one of them where you actually want to go into their Patreon, and I'll link it in the description. Patreon.com Duke's VR Tech. You want to go in here, and if you just register for the free membership, you can get the free YouTube-only player, which means you'll have a player that you can put in your world with an MRE and allows you to play any YouTube by searching the content. What we're gonna be doing here is we're actually adding a subscription payment to Duke to give us the full installation, giving us the full theater, the full karaoke, and the full experience of everything to be able to host a movie theater for yourself and your friends. So one of the things you're gonna notice on here is you go to Duke's 3D Patreon, and he's gonna have inst instructions how to install the MyScreen MRE. The MyScreen MRE is actually the full studio. Now, if you're curious of what his subscriptions are, you can go in here and you can scroll down and look at the subscriptions that he sells f with you. So most of the subscriptions are gonna be different tiers and different tiers get different things. We pay, I believe, $11 right here for the full experience. So we're able to do that with him and get the full MRE of what's needed, etc. So that's how we get across. You can actually, again, 
do the support of the free subscription, which really allows you to get the free YouTube player that everybody is allowed to have as well. So you can see this $2 MRE tier it does not include the my screens, but it kind of helps them support their cause and what they're trying to do. So let's go back to this. So we're going to go back in here and we are going to copy this my Dukes tech. So I'm going to take this just like that. I'm going to copy it and then we're going to go back to our MRE area where we were. We're just going to add a new one so you can see how it's done. We're going to go here. We're going to do create and I'm just going to call this. You can call it whatever you want. Uh, Dukes, you don't even have to call it that. Dukes mega theater. So then I'm going to paste it here in the URI. You can add an image or you can not add an image. You can, that's only on you. You can put a description if you want. MRE for full movie experience. You don't need to add any of those handles or YouTube information. You can just hit create. Once it's created, we'll go back into the MREs one more time so we can show you what it looks like. And if you go down here, you'll notice there's my Dukes. It doesn't really have an image. So now that we've got in that in there, we want to add it to our world, to our movie theater. That's going to be our next step. But before we go there, what you want to do in Allspace, and I've expressed this in another video, is you want to go to groups and you want to go to all groups. And this is the hard part. You're going to go one by one by one by one by one by one at, you know, seven, eight, nine pages of this. You're going to go one by one and you're going to join. As you can see, I've already, I'm already signed up with this group. The reason for that is each of these groups give you free stuff. So some of these in here could be ones that they're giving you props for certain things, maybe a table, maybe a, an MRE, maybe a world, etc, etc, etc. So as you can see right here, you would hit join, you would hit join again, and then I'm now part of that. So if they have any anything they're giving out for free, you'll be able to have it in your world and add it in your list. Once we have that, we're going to go back to edit a world. So to do that, you're just going to go to my worlds. You're going to select your category. So I, I'll do mine here. When you're in here, you're just going to create a world. Now, because you're doing a cinema, I'm going to take you back to the one I've already created. Here we go. You're just going to give it a name, description. If you want a picture, you can do that. In the templates, you need to scroll down to any that say cinema. This is a cinema. There's a couple of spaces that you can do, maybe venues. It's your choice. Movie theater. You can select any one of those. For us, we're going to go all the way down to the word Patreon. And this is by Artsy, one of the most amazing designers in alt space and metaverse. So we're going to go down to Patreon and we're going to select the Cozy Cinema. Now, there's an empty cinema, so you can put your own furniture, or you can do one that already has cozy cinema. So we're going to start there. Once we've selected that, there's going to be many rooms in that, so we're going to go back into our world to kind of continue showing you the rest of what we need to show you. Okay, so now, going back into the world, this is the theater we were first starting out in, the one that I was showing you that you can actually create. What we're going to do is we're now going to walk you through how to do that. Now, remember, you have to have full admin rights to the world to create and add MREs. So in this example, our cameraman, we gave him access to create in this world. So we're going to go to World Editor. And then we're going to go to the bottom one, which is the Editor panel. Once we go into the Editor panel, we're going to go under Mine. And then once we go under Mine, we're actually going to go to the last one on the list, which is the SDK apps. This is where you created that MRE. And then you're going to hit the Duke's Mega. And then you can see the little star appearing, letting you know that it's about to be created. OK, so now that we've got it set up in our theater, we could put it into the actual physical theater itself. Here, I just want to kind of give you a shout out of what you can do with it. You can shrink it, enlarge it, move it, however you want to do it. You can do any of those parts to it as you wish. 
Now, solo play is going to be, if you want to watch a movie, you can select the movie that you want to watch. Nobody else that comes into the theater is going to see that movie because it's really playing for you. So you can have different people come in and watch different movies with you at the exact same time where you're not going to hear what they're hearing. But if you want to watch a movie together, you would do watch play. Once this is forming on here, we'll wait for it to load. And right now it looks like it's playing Blade Runner, which we're not going to actually play Blade Runner. We're going to go to the bottom of the four squares, and we're going to select the four squares. Now what's going to happen, it's going to give you an alphabetical list of movies available to watch. Aquaman, Apartment 1303, Beauty and the Beast, you can kind of hit left and right. Fantastic Beast, Gemini Man, Ghost in the Shell, Ghostbusters, Riot, etc. Now, if I was to select Ghostbusters, once it's playing the movie, I can then be watching it, and in my chest, another user would see what the movie was playing and where I'm at in the movie. Right now, it's not showing it because it's just my cameraman, but another person could come in and say, oh, Israel is watching Ghostbusters. Join him now. They can select that, and you would end up going into the same exact moment that I'm watching the movie in. And this way it gives you that phone. Now, this is a 3D cinema. I know it doesn't look 3D on the screen right here, but it's actually 3D. Me staring at it looks very 3D. So right now, I'm going to pause that. I'm going to hit the power button on it to just take us to the other menus. We can also do YouTube. And YouTube is exactly what that says. It's YouTube. Once you select it, you can click the little four squares which are going to give you a search window and in the search window then you can type whatever you are looking for for it to show up in order for you to be able to do these things again you need to have full rights to the world that you have in and add that mre you can like this theater have multiple rooms to add multiple screens it's called mirroring so in the example of this i could put this theater inside my main auditorium and have other rooms with mirrors to play the same movie across the other theaters now i can put multiple players into multiple theaters and people can watch multiple things at the same time it's the same concept you're just adding it by three but remember you want to do something like that you should subscribe to Duke's Theater, and so on. Okay, so as mentioned, we were gonna give you one last cool tip for you guys here at MetaQ. So what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna show you, once you've got this all set up, we've got it here in one of our main theaters, you can actually do karaoke. Now, how would you do that? You would actually turn on karaoke uh, in the screen up high, and then you would create a mirror in front of you. So for me, I would stand down here in front of the theater, but I would have a screen, something like this, that would actually be facing me. I have it opposite so you can actually see, but it would be facing me low. So I'm facing you, the audience, and I'm karaoke as you're watching the big screen, and then that's how you would create your karaoke. You would have a mirror of the big karaoke screen. We'll go here into the karaoke section of things. And then what we're going to do is we're going to hit the four squares and we're just going to put a singer. You can put in a song, a singer, pretty much anything you want to do. You can put it in there and it'll find every karaoke version of that singer. So here it is. If I was going to do one of these, which we'll cut out so it doesn't belong on the internet. But I can hit play. It'll start playing. So that's how it would go, and I could start doing karaoke in front of me. I can see the screen as you're seeing the big screen, and you're able then to see and interact with your audience as you're singing that. You can do put a microphone in front of the screen so you can continue to give that full experience to the you know, the Patreon that's here watching you. And then you can also do a number system for them, allowing them to go next and know when they're going to go next. There are MREs directly for karaoke that do cost money, and you could probably find some free ones as well. But this one really gives us the experience of doing the entire movie experience, karaoke experience. So for me, I have a theater here that actually does a full movie. 
and then I'll have another room that does karaoke, and then I'll have another room that streams Twitch um, to Patreons so they can go dancing in another room. Here's a, here's a view of one of the rooms that we are in. So you can kind of see what it looks like, a full relax movie theater now we do have the traditional movie theater with the actual seats for right now i hope you guys enjoyed this video like and subscribe as always you know that and make sure that if you do have questions put them in the comments we're happy to make a video and help you out make the best out of metaverse for you again shout out to our friends who were asking these questions and this video was actually made for one of our friends in metaverse who wanted us to do a video in regards to how to do karaoke how to create a theater and all of that fun stuff so again it's real galindo with metacues i hope you guys enjoy this again i will see you on the next one see ya